Generic greetings and welcome to Construction Plus RimWorld once again. This is Alpha 9 and episode 4 in the previous episode. <sighs> we lost one of our colonists. There they are. Haley, the teacher. I'm afraid we lost them. Or rather a monkey attacked them. Um, I'm sure people have said it's my fault and it normally is so I'll, I'll just go with that. Uh, we've got a group of travellers from uh, politicians community passing by. That is good. Uh, we also had some savages uh, turn up as well. <laughs> <laughs> it was a proper um, sort of upper class uh, <laughs> response there. Here's some savages coming along. Okay, yes, fine. Um, but yeah, well, they came along. We had, we had a little chat. They went off. Nothing, uh, nothing of note really. We did start building this, uh, what I'm calling the cook house, which is where we will be able to cook and eat. Or people calling it the mess in the comments as well. But it's the same sort of thing. Uh, and we'll be able to actually uh, cook all of our food, store it in there. And that's just one central building. So that's what we'll be... Uh, doing there. We don't have any separate areas for the colonists to stay and the reason for that is we just haven't had any need for it yet. I mean what we have now does the job so that's that's all fine. None of them are complaining. The bonus we have is that we are giving them good meals so you can see they've got uh, a spacious interior in there. Uh, what's that? Sanguine? or oh, sanguine trait. Sharing bedroom they don't really like that but uh, Eight fine meal. They're always get plus five. They're always getting plus five, which is a good thing. So that is uh, one of the reasons why they're not kicking off all the time. They're getting good meals and they're getting regular meals. It looks like we've uh, finished our research of cremation, uh, and uh, well, that's the same one there. Let's go to research. We will set off. I think Gunter cooling because I think. It's about time we get some more gun turrets. A couple of people have mentioned that we should put our gun turrets on one circuit, and then that will allow us to connect them up to a uh, like a switch. There's a circuit switch. There you go, power switch, and then you can turn that on and off to instead of manually turning the guns off. So that's sort of understandable. We might get onto that. Uh, right. So it looks like this place is now indoors, which is good. We will go to our flooring, and we'll go to a wooden floor. And we'll set all of this to wooden. There we go. But I do want to have this one here. Uh, I think we'll go for a metal tile in the fridge. I think that makes sense to me. There we go. And then wood floors to there. Job done. Right, it says we don't have enough wood, but we do. It's all just on the floor over there. We also have no trading capacity, which is something I really do want to resolve sooner rather than later. So I think I will actually build something, some trading over here. That's been annoying some people, actually. This building is just one longer than that one there. Yeah, well, it's 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 the same length there, and it's one longer that side. That's been really annoying people. Ah, uh, OCD. Right. I'm going to go to our... I think planning... And set some planning. There we go. And that's fine. Then I want to build... That's just where the corridors are going to be. I'm going to do a wooden conduit wall. And then this is solely our trading area. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah. There we go. Something like that. Yep. Yeah. This is solely our room for uh, trading. That's all that room's going to be for. That's all it's going to be for. So we'll just have a... If I can find the thing, it'll be in... Miss Comms Console. We'll show the comms console there. Okay? And it'll go there. And that's just for trading. That's all it does. That's all the thing does. So, they'll get on with that. That'll be good. And then we can start getting this area up and running. Obviously, that'll be our cookhouse, which is obviously currently over there. This building will eventually be demolished and stuff. This was always a temporary thing. Okay, so <clears throat> I think we need to get some chairs and tables in. Let's go to furniture. And that's all steel table. I could use steel. But I just think wooden table better. Wooden table would be better. Oh, they're actually too long. Oh well, that's fine. We'll put them in there, and then we'll go to a... That's wooden table, and... Okay, it's a stool, it's not a chair. Now we'll go to our wood. There we go. One, two, three, four, and just 
Put them all in there. Obviously, this is far too big. We don't need it this big at all, but we'll just get on with it. Right, there we go. We will just let them crack on with all of that. <coughs> Obviously, production is going to be a little bit lower than before now that we've got one colonist gone, but, uh, you know, what we have left is okay. <sighs> Today's beverage is lemon tea. Right, okay. Get them chibbles and uh, chairs in. Oh, group uh, from the Kanga Combo have arrived nearby. Ah, savages. Ah, they are as well. Yes, they have a big... They have a big mallet or death, right? Let's just change that and toggle our power on. You should also notice there's some uh, resources over here, look. Some nice silver. We will pick that up. I should really go around the map and select all of that. Anyway. Um, a lot of people have been mentioning this room here. Uh, actually, there's been a couple of comments about this. This is where we, I think, I'm fairly certain, there's some cryogenic pods in there. But there will be scythes and all of them other horrible uh, gun muffalo things, which are really, really bad. This room, I'm not sure there's anything in. I think it's just a, a closed room. So, not really too worried about that. That is, um, oh, there's a male warrior that's uh, all been taken care of, I guess. Uh, and our gun is damaged. He just charged. He just charged for some reason at that thing. So, what are we going to do? Do you want to capture them? I want to move over there. Melee attack. Empath cannot fight. Oh, good grief. Yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. Okay. Uh, you go here. And then uh, fire. There, there. Resolved. Uh, we'll strip them and then uh, call that a day. Right. Yeah. We, uh, we didn't want them around here. No. No, thank you. Attack the colony. That's what happens. Okay. <clears throat> we look after our own, but uh, we don't put up with any of that crap. Okay. We will shove down, I think, some power cables. Like that. And I want to put in some... Well, I think we'll go to our MISC, and then we'll put some comms consoles in. Like that. And then we'll put a orbital beacon, which is there. That allows us to buy and sell from that location. And... Yeah, we'll probably put some flooring in. Shall we put some flooring in here? Yes, I think we need to do that flooring. And then... Gun turret cooling is finished, so our guns will fire a little bit better. That's good. What else can we do? I think we need some lighting. Hmm. Do we get some lighting in? Yeah, let's get some lighting in. We'll have a standing lamp in uh, that corner. And in here, we will have one at either side of the tables like that. And then I don't know what we're putting around here, so I will leave it. Okay. So that's all I connect up. There's some lighting. That looks quite nice. And we've got another group of travelers turning up. That's okay. And I think we just need to add in our cooler now. So we will pause it once more. We will add in our cooling. So we'll put a cooler like that. And then we will remove that stockpile. Uh, clear all. Oh, no. We'll have to actually remove it. So we'll delete that stockpile. And then we'll pause it once more. Low food. Zero nutrition worth of food in store. I know, I know, I know. Right. So we'll go for stockpile. Put it there. And that stockpile we will change to. It'll be allowed. We'll, we'll clear all. And we want to allow foods. Uh, raw resources. No, it's... Uh, it's under corpses, but not humanoid, uh, not humanoid, and not mechanical. Yep, that's all right to me. And what about chunks? Body parts. Yep, we allow body parts in there. Keep them cold. I think that'll be about right. Yep, that's about right. Okay, and the priority will be critical. There we go. And we can actually rename that if we need to. Can we rename that? We can, we can. So we'll call it, um, <clears throat> food store. Okay, there we go. I was going to call it the pantry, but, uh, some people might not know what that is. Okay, or the, the, the little cupboard under the stairs where you keep all of the tins. So, no research project, so we'll get on with more research. I've been blasting through this, uh, research, which is quite good. I think we're going to go for a hospital bed. We'll get on with that. There we go. Uh, it looks like that 
is now sorted, so we'll change that to min uh, minus one degree C. There we go, and that'll keep everything stored and cool. We will deconstruct the cooler because we don't need it. We'll do the same for our butchery table over there, and then we will put it back in. So we need a butcher's table, which will go there, I think there, and then we'll have a... Cook stove, yep, yeah, we'll definitely want a cook stove. Cook stove there, and then a brewery there. Okay, we now have brewery as well, which is good. So there is our butchery table. Could we put them? One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. We could put them all down that row. I think we'll do that. We'll deconstruct that and we'll put them down the row. It makes a bit more sense to me. Don't know why I did it the other way. So there we go, and we will get ourselves some butchery table, like that, and then a cook stove right next to it, and then brewery in the corner with a little gap. There we go. Excellent. Okay, so this was where we were going to have a bit of a, this is where we are going to have a wall, but I don't know if we actually need that. I don't know whether we want that or not. I need to put in some lamps, because it's a little bit dark back here, so I'll put a standing lamp in, like so. So this area is, looks like, minus one. Potatoes, frozen won't spoil. So he keeps flicking between uh, frozen and not frozen. So what I'll do, I'll change it to just minus six, because it really doesn't matter. <laughs> it really doesn't matter. Looks like uh, Campos is uh, doing a bit of cleaning. That's fine. Uh, mustn't have anything else to do. This is our... Zigurium, something like that. It's uh, used for uh, medical, apparently, but I've never really tried it. Okay. Do we need... Have we got any more mining to do? We do have a little bit of mining. There's some over there. That's... Oh, that's... That is compacted steel. Excellent. So let's go back and we'll go to zone. Or rather, orders. Mine. And... Mine all that. Mine all that. And we'll see what happens. Okay. So. Uh, there's a... Trade ship passing by, the Boxen Import Company. They're an exotic goods trader. Ooh, exotic goods. Right, let's just check our empath. Research of 12, social 11. Let's quick look around. Social 13. Right, camp boss, get up and have a little chat with our trader. So, looks like we've got another attack by the look of it. A local boar's gone wild. Okay, I'm not really too worried about that. So, they have sculptures. And they are actually buying. So we might start making sculptures actually. Uh, pants normal, are they gonna buy? Yeah, we can we can we can bark skin pants, why not? Um yes, yes, I understand. Cancel that, hang on. Ball attack if one see, where is it? It's coming towards us. Oh dear. Um These guys, you might want to uh, attack the ball. Don't think we're gonna have much of a problem here. Attack the bot. No, Barrett, you go down there so you're not gonna shoot him. <laughs> right, is uh looks like Strapping's hands are a little bit uh injured, but not no big bother. Right, back to They're carrying the bot. <laughs> Having a little chat with them, I think. So have another chat. They could buy pants. Buy some tribal underwear. Yeah, they can they can have that. Um, they won't even give us any money for it, but we just don't we just don't want it. We're just trying to get rid. Uh, ooh, they have a power claw. They have a heart. Uh, power claw rather. Power claw. Ooh, nice power claw. The claw. Excellent. That's pretty good. What else do we want? Uh, research. Neuro trainer. A one-use nanotech device. Insert through. The orbit of the eye and what? And releases nanomachines in the subject's brain, quickly improving their skills in a specific area. I don't think I'm going to bother with that. Uh, gold, we could sell them some gold. Thing is, we could make gold statues. I guess. Mm, I'm just going to sell them the gold, because I don't think... I'm going to sell some of the gold. I'll sell them a bit of gold. 100 gold. And... Borskin pants. I think we need them. Let's accept that. There's a bit of trading. 
bit of trading. Right, let's just check. Do, does everybody have pants? I need to check that. <laughs> Episode uh, four. We're still checking if they have pants or not. Uh, synthesized pants, yes. Cloth pants, but no shirt. Uh, what else? Where's our other colonists? I cannot find them. They're all here. Uh, yeah, everything's there. Yeah, everybody's everybody's actually clothed up. Good. But are them pants? They're synth pants. Looks like them boskin pants are actually better. There we go. Boskin pants. Sweet! Right, okay. So, let us go to our butcher table. Bill, add Bill. Butcher creature. Uh, we'll config that. It is set to animal only, not humanoid. That is fine. I'm not going to set it to do a number of times. I'm just going to set it to unlimited. Do our uh, cook fine meal. We could cook, cook a lavish meal, but the thing about a lavish meal is that uh, 10 meat, 10 vegetarian, uh, small volume ingredients like gold require... What? I'm sorry, what? Cooks a very complex meal from a combination of raw meat and raw plant ingredients. Uh, much of the ingredients are wasted. Small volume ingredients like gold require 20 times as much. What does it mean by that? By gold? We're not going to cook uh, a lavish meal. That's uh, a bit crazy. We'll co cook a fine meal and we'll config and we'll do it. Uh, <clears throat> do until I have... Do until I have, say... We always want 15 in stock. I think that's fine, yes. So we're going to always do that until we have that amount. So we could add Bill Brew Beer, but we don't yet have any place... Uh, we don't have any hops, so we'll wait until these things have grown. Two and a half days. And then we'll get on with that. Right, so we've got some mining. Uh, Connors need treatment. Why don't you just go to bed, then? Looks like a group from uh, the politician's community visiting the colony. They're always visiting them, uh, people from the politician's colony. That's good, I guess. Looks like there's a lot of... Uh, Chopping going on here. You can hear it. Slice, 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 slice. And a lot of cooking. Good, good, good. And some nice fine meals. People sitting down. Let's just check uh, Camp Ozza. And we can see that had a social chat. Very tired. Uh, sharing bedroom. Yes, obviously wearing tattered, tattered items. I know, I'm sorry. Ate a fine meal, which is good. Low expectations. Yeah, well, they're fairly okay. But they are starting to go down a little bit. Um, obviously, as soon as they get a bit of a sleep, then that's okay. We do want to... We don't want to make any more pants or t-shirts. We could make... I don't know, Parker? <laughs> uh, don't know. We don't need to make anything else just yet. Pants, t-shirt, button-down shirt, duster. Let's make a duster because we can. Why not? Why not? Looks like everybody's having a nice meal and such, and that area is nice and cool, indoors, that's all working fine. And we've now got our hospital bed as well, that's great. Okay, let's just go to my, um, I think planning once more, we'll pause it again, we need to do a bit more planning here because we need to, look at that shovel snow, I don't think we'll be doing that. Uh, we need to just sort out our, we're gonna have like a crafting area, so... We'll open a fairly, we'll have a big building over here, and I think we'll have it, I have a big storeroom in the back for like stone and stuff, like raw material. So, for example, we'll have uh, maybe, I don't know, that corner there is a store area. And we'll store a lot of raw material, like for example, uh, well, stone and stuff like that. Oh, do we need to? I don't think we really need a storage area for stone, although... It would be beneficial to carry the stone and then get on with it. The things we want to make, uh, we want to store things like our our raw raw ingredients, so well, raw materials rather, so stone and uh, rocks and rubble and I guess leather, that sort of thing would go in there. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Uh, we'll have a sculptor's table and a smithing bench and a stone cut's table. We need a lot of uh, things in here. So we'll have... I guess if you come in this door here, we'll have... One, two, three. We'll have sort of... 
Do I want to do that? Hmm. Let's go back to our remove plans. Should probably work out if we have, say, a stone cutter table there, and then a sort of smithing thing there. Or rather, we'll cancel that. We'll have a little bit of a gap. Right, and that'll go around like that. Okay, it's starting to take shape. Then we'll have an entrance to the other area there. There we go. Then we'll have a... We need like an electric smelter, which I believe is that size. Something like that. And we'll get a, a gap of two. And then this wall will need to go there. And then we will remove that. Okay, so the entrance will be there. And then it was smooth floor. Hmm, designate rough stone to be uh, terrain to be smoothed. I didn't know about that. Right, I've probably seen it before and just not noticed or forgot about it. Right, okay, so we have a walls all the way around. This is a storage. That will be an electric smelter. If I just go to uh, production, uh, we'll have a smithing bench there, then a sculptor's table, stone cutter's table something else. We can have anything we want there. We do need to shift the research bench, but I don't know where we're going to put that. I'm thinking maybe a separate building back here. I like the idea of just separate buildings. It just seems a bit, I don't know, just some, you know, it's interesting, isn't it? Different and such. So, maybe we'll put in its own separate building back there. Yes, I think we will. We will do that. Right, yes, that, that, that's fine. I think that is perfectly doable. Let's just check our crematorium. Can we not do that? You have no usable materials which to build this. You need slate blocks. Slate! Okay. We'll have to get on with that. Right, so this, this building is sorted. Let's go to uh, wooden conduit wall and then we will build all the way around. Actually, I think I might extend the storage. No, the storage is fine. We don't need any more storage. There we go. There's that building and then a wooden door. Job done. Okay, there's that sorted. Uh, one, uh, one person's wandering idle. I think we'll get a bit of research then. And we'll go for electric smelting. Because we're going to get on with that. But I guess we're going to need slate blocks. Hmm. We'll have to get on with that. I'm going to go to our architect tab and orders. And then go for a bit of mining. And we'll go mine all of that there. Because we need to get on with that. Anything else around here? Nothing that I can see. Don't know where we're going to get slate. I don't know how you get that. That is an interesting one. Uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of resources on this map. A lot of people have been saying we should tunnel into the uh, into here, but uh, I don't know. We'll have to see about that. A group of tribes people from uh, Talbot Ton have arrived nearby. They'll prepare for a while, then attack. Uh, it's it's just one guy with a bow and arrow, uh, and a cluster of cargo pods has dropped nearby and dropped. Ooh, lots of silver. It's not really nearby. It's close. No, it's not really nearby at all. What's that? That's marble. That's marble. There's another empty building. Marble. Oh, they're beginning their assault. We need to just uh, reconnect that thing. Oh, to does designate the toggle power. You, Barry, get on with the get on with the toggle the toggle the thing with the. Urgh, you can't. Anyone else? You? Can you operate? Yes. He can do it. Quickly get over there before uh, Mr. Archer gets there. And obviously we have gun turret cooling now, so um... What a shot! Oh my good grief, that guy's a legend! Okay, we're dealing with Robin Hood. Um, <laughs> look at that! He's really good. Let's just get uh, strapping to run up because that guy's firing his bow and arrow and doing um, exceptionally well with it. Now go around that way, please. And go up to there. Now, uh, Strapping's getting shot at. And we'll fire at him now. So we've got a bit of cover. But apparently that doesn't matter. Because we just got hit straight in the face. Good grief. That archer. Is surgical. You know what? I think we're going to capture him. I think someone like him. Let's have a look at his character. Shooting and melee and social is quite good. Medicine's up there as well. His whole body is uh, bleeding out and such, so I think we might save him. We've only got eight medicine, but I think we will. Blood loss, bite scar. Right, so we're going to have to get medicine, try to recruit, friendly chat. Do you want to give him medicine? Yeah, 
I think we're going to try and recruit him. Right, I think we're going to leave it there because we are well, we're progressing on quite nicely. Next episode, we will see if we can recruit Redfield and we'll get up this, um, well, I don't know what building you would call it, our production building. Yeah, it's the main production building. More travellers turning up, that's good. We are running out of medical supplies, so that's something I'm going to have to deal with, but uh, we will see what happens. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I guess we will. As always, comments in the comments. Thanks very much for watching. Take care and generic parties.